Keely for Soy and Shea and thank you for joining me. Today I am going to show you what has gone into the main mystery box. The main mystery box when you went online to order it came with a choice of fragrances which included lemongrass and Persian lime, champagne and strawberries, lavender or sandalwood and clove. So let's go and see why you had that choice. So the first item that we are adding into the box is a reed diffuser and this is why I wanted you to choose a fragrance when ordering. A reed diffuser can last anywhere from 6 to 18 months depending where you um, place the reed diffuser. If you've got it in an area that gets a lot of natural airflow, it's going to last for around that 6 to 12 months. Whereas if it's in a, say, the spare bedroom where it doesn't get a lot of airflow, doesn't get a lot of sunlight, then it's likely to last 12 to 18 months. So I needed you to like the fragrance that the reed diffuser came in hence I let you choose which fragrance you wanted to put into it so we'll get this one wrapped up and into the box so the next item going into our box is one of our baby candles and this is in the matching fragrance to the reed diffuser our baby candles are all hand poured using soy wax and will last 10 to 12 hours and in these cooler winter months they will burn a lot slower so you'll get that longer time out of them um, we'll pop this into the box. This particular size is great for smaller rooms such as bathrooms, studies and offices. So the next item going into the box is one of our foaming sugar scrubs in the Hawaiian Honey Blossom. Hawaiian Honey Blossom is our most popular bath and body fragrance and it's available in all of the bath and body range. The foaming sugar scrub, it comes in three different sizes, but I'm including the 100 gram pot in here. It's a cleanser, exfoliator and moisturizer all in one tub, so it's excellent for in the shower. Um, it is on a cleanser base, so that's the cleaning part. And then it has some sugar whipped through it for exfoliation. And it also has some added oils and kaolin clay, which is really nice and moisturizing on the skin. So you can do your cleaning, exfoliating and moisturizing all in one go with this little pot. So we'll pop that in the box there. So in autumn and winter, I release our body butters. We were a little bit late releasing them this year because it has been so warm. But now that the days have finally cooled down, this has been reintroduced back into the range. And I'm adding in the matching one to that sugar scrub, so the Hawaiian Honey Blossom. Our whipped body butters are shea, mango and cocoa butter. And they're mixed in with jojoba, coconut and camellia oil. Um, it has been developed so that it is not greasy on the skin like some can be and it does sink in. The difference between a body butter and a moisturiser is that a moisturiser is very much so water based and sinks into the skin. Whereas a body butter is a blend of butters and oils so it takes a little bit longer to actually go down into the skin but it does leave a bit more of a protective barrier over the top of the skin to keep you nice and moisturised. So we pop that into the box as well. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to add in is one of our artisan bars of soap. And I've chosen one of the high top ones. And this particular soap is in Juicy Clementine. And the reason I chose this particular um, fragrance is because the mandarins or clementines have just come back into season here. And I love nothing better then actually ripping open one of those little mandarins and that fresh zesty smell that you get from them and this is what that soap smells of. So I've included that and we'll pop that into the top of the box there. So now that winter's here it's time to start thinking about our lips. So to do that I have included some of the whipped butter sugar lip scrub. These little pots of lip scrub are relatively new to the range and they come in six different flavours and the flavour included in the box was random. This particular one is snow cone. There is a blend of mango, shea and cocoa butter in there and then it's all whipped together with some sugar as well as a couple of other skin loving oils including castor oil. And um, the idea behind them is that you take a little bit on your finger, rub it over your lip and it just exfoliates them gently and then you rinse it off with some warm water and the butters and oils that go into this help to moisturise the lips. So these are really, really good in winter when your lips are just feeling that little bit sore, cracked and dry. So we'll pop that into the box. Now to go with that lip scrub, I have included the matching lip balm and these are all handmade by myself and also include that cocoa butter, avocado oil and vitamin E. 
Um, they are petroleum free and I chose the flavour based on whichever lip scrub went into the box. So I'll pop that in there as well. So finally we'll pop in our 10 reeds to go with the reed diffuser and also a little leaflet to tell you about all the different products that have gone into the box with their recommended retail price and there is a massive value of $63 in this box here. So now it's time to get it wrapped up and post it out. that is the May mystery box all done and sent out for the month. The June mystery box is now available to purchase right up until the 30th of June. The boxes start shipping out from the 12th of June which just gives me time to make them up and they do include free shipping to anywhere within Australia and I will be back on the 1st of July to do a reveal of the June box which will include um, some exclusive um, products as well as some new products as well. So thanks for watching until next time. Bye!